Hey guys, Todd Helms with Eastman's Hunting Journals out here on this glorious August morning to bring you a review on the brand new Leupold VX6 HD 4 to 24 by 52 CDS TZL illuminated TMOA. Wow, that's a tongue twister. It's a big name for an awesome scope. I'm gonna break down all the features with this scope. So if you're in the market for a new big game hunting rig, you can give a hard look at this one because it's a Leupold VX6. Need I say more? All right, so while I've got you here, drop down, punch that subscribe button, leave us a comment, let us know what you like about the video, uh, any questions that you might have, and I'll do the best I can to get back to you and answer those or respond. Uh, make sure that you're turning on your notifications bell too so you get notified and get a heads up every time that we drop hot content here like these gear reviews at Eastman's. Well, let's dive into this review of this rifle scope. I'm gonna tell you why if you're in the, in the market for a new hunting scope, you need to give a hard look at the VX6 HD. Um, if you're looking for a scope in this class, virtually in this size and magnification range, guys, after this review, you're going to know what you need to know to help you make a better decision about the purchase of this thing. All right, so first and foremost, big scope. It is, it's a big, it's a big scope. This is, it's big, but man, it's surprisingly light. This thing only weighs 25.5 ounces. Put it in a class with uh, some first focal planes, because this is, this is a second focal plane reticle. Um, but if you put it in a class with some of the first focal planes, it's gonna come in for a scope this size a little bit lighter because it's designed as a hunting specific scope. Can you use it for competition as well? Sure, absolutely. But it's purpose built to hunt. And honestly, that's what matters really most to me. So let's take a look at it. It's a four to 24. In other words, it's a six to one zoom ratio. I can, I can go from four power all the way to 24 power. That is a massive zoom ratio, guys. If you're going to be hunting with it and want to use the TMOA reticle, you have to have it set on the correct power setting for that reticle to subtend correctly. Because it's a second focal plane scope, you need to consult your manual with this scope if you're going to use the TMOA reticle to have the power setting correct on here so, the retic so that TMOA reticle subtends correctly in the field. And the TMOA reticle in this scope is a great combination of the windplex reticle and a vertical MOA hash reticle. 10 MOAs above the crosshair, 10 MOAs below the crosshair, 10 left, 10 right. So any way you need to go with this scope, you have 10 MOAs of hash marks to adjust. The CDS TZL3 dial is an updated dial for Leupold in that it brings in to the fold some target shooting attributes, if you will. Right here on this, it's a standard CDS dial, but it also has a revolution indicator right here. Even though the scope features zero lock, if I'm way out on my rev revolutions and I'm not sure where I'm at, I can quick look at that revolution indicator and go, okay, I haven't gone a full revolution. Or if I'm all the way down at 20, which is a full revolution on this dial, I also have a zero lock windage dial that can't turn, guys. That's so important in the field for a hunting rifle. These dials can't turn in the field. If I'm putting this in a backpack or I'm putting it in a scabbard on a horse or whatever the scenario may be, I know that when I sit down, this thing's not gonna have moved. In, the hunting, in a hunting scenario, things get hot, things get heavy, and things are hurried, and I might need to make an adjustment I know my scope's gonna be locked in place, be in the field. And that, that's just an extra peace of mind that if you're hunting with a dial, man, that system, that zero lock system that Leupold has is just phenomenal. All right, so the four to 24 by 52. 52 is your objective lens on this scope. 52's big. Um, and you can see on this gun, I've got a pick rail and I have medium rings. I could probably go a little bit lower, but I like to have my head nice and vertical on my rifles, and so I went with medium rings. Point being, 52 gives you, a 52 millimeter objective gives you a ridiculous amount of light gathering capability 
which is super important in hunting scenarios where we're hunting so often, we're hunting right until the end of legal shooting light. And lighting, situ lighting conditions might be iffy, first thing in the morning, last thing in the evening, and we're, that's when those big animals come out. That's when the moment of truth happens so often. Having a scope like this one with a big 52 millimeter objective to gather the maximum amount of light is crucial. That's a lot of light gathering capability. This thing's like a light gathering vacuum. Once you add the 52 millimeter objective with the 34 millimeter tube and Leupold's professional grade optical system, which is their proprietary coatings, on these lenses, this is one of the brightest rifle scopes that I have ever used. And that's one of the reasons, honestly, that I'm a Leupold fanboy. I love their glass. I love how it gathers light. I love how clear it is. Let's talk more about that professional grade optical system. The professional grade optical system is what Leupold calls basically all their proprietary lens coatings and lens technology. What that does, guys, it's, it's like an umbrella term for a whole bunch of science, <laughs> for lack of a better term, because you're looking at lens coatings, you're looking at uh, you're looking at lens materials, you're looking at all kinds of uh, scratch resistance and UV uh, filters in this glass. I don't know exactly what Leupold does as far as the science behind all of it, but I do know that it works. I know that when I sit down behind this glass, it's clear, it's crisp, it's bright. Every time I've used this scope at the range or other VX6s in the field, the optical clarity, the optical performance is exactly what I want. It's crisp, it's clear, it's clean. There's no distortion. Water beads up on these lenses, which I'm very careful with these things, but Leupold also includes these magnetic flip-up scope caps on all the VX6s, which are awesome. They help keep dirt out, they help keep rain, moisture, snow, whatever, out, on, off, out of the scope and off your lenses. All right, another thing that this VX6 4-24 CDS TZL3 has is it has a uh, leveling reticle in it. It's illuminated, so all I have to do put the battery in my parallax cap and I just touch it. All it does is, all it does, when I touch that like that, I can adjust the brightness levels of the reticle. But one of the cool things too that I can do with this is once that thing's on, it will show me whether or not that scope is level, that reticle is level. There is an indicator inside the scope that will show if I'm twisting or tilting that gun. Anytime you start extending your range in, in hunting or target shooting, rifle cant becomes a factor. If you're canting, in other words, if your rifle is not level when you're shooting it, it's going to affect your bullet's impact on target. Leupold has figured that out and taken, the, taken one more step out of the equation. Again, I could check my rifle's level. If I've done the homework and leveled the scope, leveled the scope with the rifle ahead of time so it's perfectly in tune, that illuminated leveler in there and that reticle is going to show me that, hey, you're bud, you need, to, you need to cant to the right a little bit, you're out of level. You saw me turn this thing on. I don't have to worry about turning it off because once it's on, if after the rifle sits motionless for a certain period of time, it shuts itself off. So you're not gonna run through a bunch of those little batteries. I feel like anytime you get into performance level scopes, high-end performance scopes that have big that have big tubes and big objectives and lots of zoom capability you're going to get more weight and there comes a point when you're tripping over dollars to pick up dimes with some of this stuff that's not the case with the vx6 hd 4 to 24 cds tzl3 i honestly can't think of a scenario that i use a rifle in that this scope doesn't handle. This magnification throw lever is super smooth. I also like the removable throw lever that Leupold includes. Um, if I don't want it on there, I can take it off. I really like the included scope caps, flip up scope caps. These things, I've been using these for a long, lot of years now. And they just work. Um, I don't necessarily need a cover for this scope because I have these 
That's my review of the Leupold VX6 HD 4 to 24 by 52 CDS TZL3. Big name for an awesome scope. If you are in the market for a high performance, high end hunting scope that can take you to the range and through competition as well, guys, you gotta give this one a look. It's feature packed, performance heavy, and I like it. Check it out at loophole.com and they'll get, you can run down video, more videos there, see more in-depth specs, you're gonna like it. So hey guys, thanks for joining us today on this review and until next time, we'll see you in the field.